look if Trump is in a rational enough mind to make a decision on this with Syria. Okay. Is Trump rational enough to, to be dealing with Syria? Well, what we have here, Knight of Wands. So we to figure out who that is. I would say this is probably Trump. They are brooding on what's taking place. Okay. On the other side of it, we have King of Wands. Maybe that's Bolton. So he looks pretty severe there. What's underneath of it is he's, you know, this money and, and he's sitting there, uh, you know, just kind of, and he's worried about uh, the and the high priestess about what's going on behind the scenes. Well, I think he's more brooding on that and the drama, okay? And the first card that came out was playfulness. And I don't think it's playfulness. I think he's just kind of, you know, scattered. Like, you know. So who this one is, I'm not sure. I'm trying to figure out, unless that's... Uh, Muller in the investigation that's going on at the center of things. Let's see, let's use the other cards and see what we get with that. Who's at the center of this? Because I think he's just scattered. He's just, you know, I guess it's his moment. No, that's, what's the devil? Devil, so who is that? Who is that? Unless that's Bolton. Let's look and see. Again. King of Wands, okay. King of Wands, got King of Wands twice with the devil. Knight of Wands, King of Wands. Okay, let me see a little more what we have with this. Death. Ooh, okay, I think this has to do with the King of Wands and the thing with the devil and death. Yeah, because this other one's got to be. I think the other one, the Knight of Wands here, has to be just the other people on the board representing basically the rest of the people on the board because they take their their hits, you know. They've taken their hits there. The rest of the ones that are over there in Syria now still there. Yeah, they're, 
in that position. And I think that over here we have, because I got it twice, again, the King of Wands with the Devil and with Death. So I would say that's probably Bolton. Probably Bolton. Yeah, that's Bolton. Let's see what we have over here, because this has to be Trump brooding and, and stuff. So let's see what we've got with Trump here. Yeah, he's wanting to be there with everybody. He's wanting to be the big cheese and everybody following hail to the chief, you know, again, make our alliances. Trump and his ego. And then at the same time, he's brooding over what's going on behind the scenes with this. So it's just, yeah. Yeah, so I don't, you know, it doesn't look like he's really in a good position he is not in a good position with with anything to be thinking about any of these things let's see what the ones in the the rest of our people here let's see what the rest of our people that are there the rest of the military oh, they're feeling a bit hung at the moment with this Okay, they're, they're a bit feeling like they've got a, a little less power and, and tied up. Feeling hung up and tied up with all this stuff. Yeah, when it comes to their dealings in the world, they've got to take, I guess, the most information from Trump and Bolton. And it's like, we got Bolton here and Trump his alter ego. But the... T Oh God, does not look good. Okay, let's see what we got with the uh, with this. Yeah, that other one is still going forward about the money and all the other stuff that's going on. Yeah, that top one has to do with Mueller and all the stuff that he's putting into place, which is heartache for for Trump. It's getting so again. We have. You know, the investigation, they're still going forward with it, you know, slowly. <laughs> That's why we have our guy on slow-mo here. And again, he's still looking into all their dealings, their business dealings. This is, again, Mueller coming forward, continue to looking, you know, and he's rapidly bringing forth that power and it's, you know, a heartache to, to Trump. It's like, crap, this stuff is coming down. So again, he wants to be a big leader in, in chief, make those alliances, but at the same time he's, he's brooding about that and he's, you know, scattered just. So yeah, it, it, is he in a good position now to be leading this thing on Syria? Uh, I'd have to say not really when he's got Bolton there and the rest of the military is looking like they're, they're feeling like they're hung out to dry in this thing because Trump doesn't listen to anybody. And now he's got Bolton and Bolton wants to always, you know, he's a hawk, he wants to... Uh... So we're going to have to watch this one carefully what's going to play out with this hopefully these cards are wrong and that the military the rest of them are able to segue and and uh get them off of this or else it could be not great so we'll okay we'll wait and see well, maybe I'll look at one more thing. So what's going to be the outcome? Let me see if I can find out what's going to be the outcome with this. What's going to be the outcome? Are the rest of the military in the room going to be able to talk some sense in them, 
into them what is going to be the outcome with this meeting for the Syria. Let's see what we have. Let's hope they're able to talk some. They're going to have to romance him, schmooze him. <laughs> romance. We're going to have to schmooze him to get him to listen. They're going to have to play him. They have to play him. They have to, to feed his ego. they got to schmooze him to get him to, to hear anything. Lord have mercy. Okay, let's see what we've got here. What's going to be the outcome? Are the rest of the military going to be able to talk some sense into Trump? And mm, Middle. Again, trying to juggle it. Trying to juggle it. And they're like on a precipice up there trying to do it. Yeah. Trump's for death. Trump's for death. And they're out for, again, money for what they can, uh, yeah, they got ulterior motives above it. Might have channels and below it. Working. Okay. So I think they're really working to, you know, have this message strong, be a strong message, a strong showing. But again, it's the, the cups, it's a strong showing, but you know, they're trying to do all they can to work to put this into motion and schmooze, get, bring some balance there, schmoozing the president, you know, because his leaning is for death and uh, you know again what they can gain out of it for him and his uh, him and Bolton him and Bolton terrible situation in Syria terrible situation Trump's all about his ego, about his ego with it, and you know, keeping his keeping his easy lifestyle and, and keeping himself protected in his little thing, and not really seeing what's going on. Okay, again, all about the money and that life. Okay, so he's he's not really. He doesn't want to listen so um, anyway but the military the, the other generals and things there are going to do all they can to schmooze him and try to say look we can we can get there we can do it we can bring a strong presence but you know try to modify him some try to modify him in Bolton so we'll see what happens we'll have to keep an eye on it namaste thank you for tuning in have a great evening